An exciting new form of technology is making operating on breast cancer patients easier and less painful. It hopes to revolutionize the process and make the surgery process more streamlined. What makes it different than previous technologies created to treat cancer? Well, for more on this, new Canadian technology, we're joined by CEO Anant Ravi, and we're also joined by one of the earliest patients to use the technology, Angela Alexander Broker. Good morning to you as well. And can I just say, here in your morning, we're bringing the two of you together because you've never actually spoken. I know this is great. No, we haven't. So this will be a great conversation to have. Uh, and Anthony, I'm going to start with you. Sure. This technology was developed at your lab at Sunnybrook Hospital in Toronto. Explain to everybody, how does it work? So at Molly Surgical, we're all about making the entire process of delivering breast cancer care simpler. Simpler for the patient undergoing the treatment, simpler for the radiologist who has to find the tumor market for removal, and simpler for the surgeon who then has to take out the tumor. And we do this by implanting a tiny marker. And is that it there? That's it. It's the size of a sesame seed, believe it or not. And we use that to mark it. And then the surgeon uses that wand, we call it the magic wand, because the magic's in the wand, to precisely locate that marker and remove the tumor with confidence and precision. And that benefits the, uh, the, the patient because it gives them the confidence that the surgeons have the tools to remove your cancer with minimal defect to their their cosmetic effect. Fascinating technology. We love that it's Canadian. Angela, I want to bring you into this conversation. First of all, set up for us. What was your experience with breast cancer like? Well, it was very frightening. I had um, my what I thought was my last um, routine mammogram in March, and uh, because I was going to be 74, and uh, it came back fine. And then two months later, at the beginning of May, I was doing a self exam and found a lump. Um, in the upper part of my right breast. Of course, it was very frightening. Um, I got in touch with my doctor straight away, and she organized um, an ultrasound for me, and that showed that there was something not quite right. And so I was uh, sent on to have uh, more um, in-depth um, examination. I had um, a biopsy. Um, it came back. Um, that with a marker, so it, it, set, it looked like it wasn't quite right. So they decided to do um, a lumpectomy. And um, of course, instead of having the old procedure, I was able to have uh, the seed implanted. Um, the radiologist implanted it, it was absolutely painless. Uh, it was, it really made me feel a lot better. The people that were involved in the um, Insertion of it were all very kind, and then I had um, um, uh, another mammogram to make sure that it was settled in the right spot. And then Dr. Lobricks did the lumpectomy. Um, he was able to get all of the margins. He was able to tell my husband straight away that everything was fine. Um, it was just a tremendous relief for me, just tremendous. Uh I know you can't see this, um, but Anant's face, as you're describing your experience, he's just smiling and nodding and nodding. What is it like to hear <laughs> her, her side of it? I mean, it's not just, it's, it's everything. I mean, it, it oh. is the reason why our team is toiling to bring the technology to Canadians close to home. And we have a team of young innovators, and this motivates them to keep looking for ways to improve the experience, not only for patients, but also for care teams, which we know are are completely overburdened taking care of patients. So, you know, this is everything to us. So thank you again, Angela. Um, thank you for well, sharing thank your story. Well, thank you very much. And for everyone that was involved in the development of this, I mean, it's really, uh, it was absolutely pain-free. Um, when I had the, sur when I had the uh, lumpectomy, there was very, very little tissue taken out. Wow. Um, you know, my breasts are, there was a small amount, but very, very little. I'm just so, so pleased. And now Dr. Lovrick said, I'm good to go. I just have to go and have um, a mammogram every couple of years again. So that's okay with me. From the vision and creation that you had for this to being able to speak to somebody like Angela, it was amazing to bring the both of you together. An incredible moment. Incredible to hear about this technology, Canadian technology, both from you and from someone who's experienced firsthand. Angela, I'm glad to hear that you do it all right. And Anath, great to meet you here in studio. Nice Thank you both for being on your morning. Thank you. Bye-bye now. I'll put their numbers in contact with one another in just a moment. <laughs> we'll be right back.